There was a tiny moment at John McCain's funeral where former President Bush handed you a cough drop. It may have been a nothing to some people, but when you watched that moment, we realized how important that tiny moment was, right? I didn't realize at the time that anybody noticed what we were doing. We were sitting together, you know, uh, President Bush and I, we are forever seatmates because of protocol. That's how we sit at all the official functions. So he is my partner in crime at every major thing where all the formers gather. So we're together all the time and I love him to death. He's a wonderful man, he's a funny man. And it was a simple gesture. He was getting a cough drop from Laura and I looked over and I, I, I said, hand me a cough drop. And he was like, oh, okay. And I will add that they were old cough drops. <laughs> That's the funny thing because they were in the little White House box, yeah. the oh. Altoids. And I was like, how long have you had these? And he said, a long time, we got a lot of these. Well, it was one of those moments where people felt like, oh, there's a little bipartisan moment, even just as <laughs> simple that, as a cop drop. That's why it matters so much, because that's what people are hungry for. They're hungry for what we all know that, you know, party doesn't separate us, color, gender, those kind of things don't separate us. You know, it's the messages that we send. Uh, and if we're, if we're the adults and the leaders in the room and we're not showing that level of decency, we cannot expect our children to do the same. So that's what I think about when I think about the gestures and the symbols and uh, what our words mean and the impact that it has. I think about the next generation every single time.